bachcho welcome to episode number 2 of the podcast series and i have my very old student here one of my favorites we meeting him for the third time today and his name is ganesh super kind super smart super intelligent absolutely brilliant student bahut kuch karta hai padhai ke alawa bhi to chalo aaj ganesh se baatein karte hain aur bahut cheeze jante hain aaiye ganesh come the hot seat is all yours how are you good to see you um so ganesh uh, how did i get in touch with ganesh is uh, ye serendipity nahi hui main airport mein nahi mili <laughs> yes i met ganesh uh, in vedantho office once uh, uske baad ek hamara function hua tha vedantho ka so we met at the hotel outside jahan function ho raha tha and today i'm meeting him for the third time bahut kuch kar raha hai ye bachcha apni podcast series chala raha hai mental health ke bare mein baat karna chahta hai छोटी uh, सी एज में बहुत सारी डीप चीज़ों के बारे में सोचता है बात करता है इज बिन इन टच विद मी आज का पॉडकास्ट बहुत डिफरेंट है वी डोंट हैव अ एम्स टॉपर हेयर वी डोंट हैव समबडी गोइंग टू एम वी हैव अ रियल स्टूडेंट जैसे 95 परसेंट होता है डू लाइक दर इंट्रोडक्शन लाइक हाउ नाइन्टी नाइन्टी फाइव परसेंट स्टूडेंट आर हिट ट्रायल एक एग्जाम क्लियर हो गया शायद दो नहीं हुए दो एग्जाम क्लियर हो गए शायद तीन नहीं हुए कहीं पर अच्छा स्कोर आया कहीं पर नहीं अच्छा स्कोर आया यू नो सो सो द रियल लाइफ इस इस इसको कैसे यू नो एंड जो आपके साथ और होगा कईयों का इलेवंथ बर्बाद हो गया होगा ट्वेल्थ में एवरेज हुआ होगा कईयों का नीट क्रैक हो चुका होगा नहीं क्रैक हो रहा होगा सो ऑल दीज रियल लाइफ थिंग्स गणेश एंड मी आर गोन टू टॉक अबाउट गणेश टू बिगिन विथ आई सी अज चेंज इन यू आई सी अ नाइस बिग मैसिव चेंज इन यू फ्रॉम द फर्स्ट टाइम दैट आई मेट यू टू टूडे इमीजिएटली आफ्टर द एग्जाम यू टॉक अबाउट हाउ यू वॉन्ट हेल्प योर स्कूल किड्स यू वॉन्ट टॉक अबाउट मेंटल हेल्थ From where did this mindset change come, Ganesh? Talk about it. ये कैसे कैसे from maybe nine ten में you would have not been so confident, shy to what you your big aims, your big dreams. ये कैसे हुआ, Ganesh? If you can speak in Hindi, English, English, whatever is comfortable to you. But ये कैसे? How did this mindset mindset shift occur? So it is because of my teachers that I had this uh, mindset shift. So I've learned uh, two very valuable lessons in these two three years of journey. First is believing in journey before destination oh lovely and second is step by step learning if you see in all these stages of uh, growth and development from a child first a child learns to turn over then to sit then to crawl and then finally walk and run similarly each step is important and each step step takes a milestone yeah in the same way if we approach <coughs> life from a step by step learning mm-hmm. perspective it becomes easier mm-hmm. so for most needs uh, meet aspirants physics is a very difficult subject but for me it became easy because of my uh, teacher's way of teaching he believed in step by step learning so all for almost 3 months we were doing only maths and physics so all the students were like why are we wasting 3 months on maths but when we finished the basic maths in first 3 months we started very early in february when we were still in finished tenth just finished tenth so learning basic maths for the first 3 Months. months of these must have been so boring no yeah, that time boring. yeah but after when we started approaching physics most students fear maths and physics but now we long we didn't have that fear of wow. maths anymore that was because we started and this happened in vedanto yes this happened in vedanto and then we started with kinematics and as the physics Correct. course so in the step by step learning when you focus on one task at a time it becomes easier when you finally collect all the tasks together and one more very big goal and very big learning that i have had from vedanto is journey before destination if you see the process is where the thing happens it is the beauty of the process and not the goal most of us we start focusing on the goal but it is the process that is beautiful so there is the story that our uh, teacher once told us so there was a boy who was very fascinated by the butterfly he saw in his garden So he asked his mother for a butterfly. His mother bought him a caterpillar. Correct. And she asked him, "You take care of this, and soon it will turn into the beautiful butterfly which you asked." So he started taking care of it. Soon it turned out into a cut c- cocoon, and it started growing. And one day he uh, he saw a slight crack on the cocoon. So on seeing that, he gets really impatient, and he cuts the cocoon so that the butterfly could come out fast. But when the butterfly came out, it was very ugly and with a broken leg. Here. The boy wanted a beautiful butterfly but it was not at all like he expected because a process was skipped. Need is not a shortcut or it is not a overnight success. It is a 2 year long process and each 
step is Correct. very important during Correct. the journey Correct. so we have to realize one thing it is the beauty in the process and not in the goal so this way we started enjoying learning and enjoying learning physics on focusing on the process Beautiful. rather than the i'll tell you a story here i'm so tempted to tell you something so i was the first person to join vedantu in the bio team there was nobody zero nobody nobody means nobody they were founders and i was the first person to join the bio team koi nahi tha no teacher no uh, subject matter expert no dtp no no one you know how i started so our business team used to give us phone numbers and before that i was a center head of five centers before i i joined vedant and we had some 4 5000 students so when i came here they used to give me numbers aaj ke ye panch number hai panch number pe i used to call kaun bol raha hai aapka naam kya hai then they used to sometimes cut the call sometimes receive the call aapke bacche ka naam kya hai acha bachcha my first student which i taught in vedantu was a 8th standard student and i used to teach neat center head five centers 8th standard when you talk about the journey and i taught her for three four months i used to call her in the morning aaj hum kya padhenge she used to tell me what you used to sing then i used to prepare slides for her then i used to teach her devanshi was her name i still remember 2015 14 15 15 types that is one to one i did that for one and a half years which me i got so frustrated my salary was 8 10000 rupees i was so frustrated i was so frustrated i said hey bhagwan where have you put me what have i done to where i by teaching one one child what am i doing in life then from there we made a batch one to many this was one to one one to one i had some six seven students full day i used to teach morning 7 to 8 one child 9 to 10 another child 10 to 11 another child after teaching 7 8 hours like this i used to get only 12 13000 rupees because every child used to get like 2 300 rupees per hour imagine then we made one to many then finally i said thank god i told anand vamsi pulke i said aisa to na ho payega bhai ek ek bacche ko padha rahi hu itni jaan lagti hai pura gala phad jata hai mera subah se leke shaam tak one child and i am sitting and explaining then we made a batch first batch was 18 students one eight 2017 i'm telling you first batch i used to make slides i used to take parent teacher meeting i used to call i used to do everything that wave book you see where teachers load i that i don't know wave book ka 100th version purana we used to load on our own and make slides that was one too many then first webinar started then that small batch became 30 40 50 then webinars i still remember i took first webinar for vedantu and somehow 200 students came i was like 200 i want to just die of happiness right now 200 was such a big number and pulkit sir was standing outside i went out there pulkit sir in my webinar 200 students this also 4 years ago before pandemic i'm telling then we started youtube channel then i was in assam i used to take one hour to record channel internet was so bad we never used to take live then i used to upload it in 3 hours sitting sitting there was a software called screencast o matic which vedant had taken for me we used to record Oh God! Then before the pandemic, 2018, 19, we started YouTube channel. First, five thousand, ten thousand, fifteen thousand, twenty thousand to lakhs today, right. right? So, like, also, like, a lot of people ask me that why don't you leave Vedanto? Why don't you do something? this? This journey has been so precious, has been so priceless and so beautiful. And the ownership that I get that this is mine. We've done it. It's just so fabulous. So I totally believe you when you say so. it's is a journey yeah as biology people you and me here sitting here we have many examples to prove this we see cancer spends 80% of its life undetectable but then invades the body within months correct similarly a uh, bamboo if you see for the first 5 years yes. it's underground building correct. its root system so that time it might seem to be like making no progress but within the next 6 months 6 weeks it grows up to 90 feet in the air so this way it is the journey that is correct been- lovely what do you learn from failure so you know you must have had some story where you felt that you are a failure or the world must have told you that kum se na ho payega so what has your journey been in terms of success everybody talks but in terms of those students who have not been able to do it this year or who feel that they have not been able to do it tell us that failure story all, or what has it taught you yeah I think the society and we are all told to avoid failure. Failure is one word we are taught. Absolutely, hundred percent. Yes. So, but I think without failure, there is no success at all. I think it was two years back. I didn't clear KVPY. 
I had missed my NTSC also by one mark, and that was the last year of KVPY. It stopped after that, so I couldn't give KVPY again in my life also. So I was thinking I'm a loser. I couldn't do anything more, and that is when uh, our teacher walked into the class, class of fifty students that day. He took out a hundred uh, rupee note in his hands. Ah. He asked it, "How many of you guys want this note?" Naturally, all of them said yes. Then he folded the note. And still asked again, how many of you want this? Yet again, all fifty hands went up. Then he crumbled the note and asked, how many of you want this note? Yet again, all fifty hands went up. Then he threw it on the ground, stamped, stamped it with his shoes, picked it up. Now it's with a little dirt and crumbled it even more. And now asked, how many of you want this note? Yet again, all fifty hands went up. Not even one child didn't want the note anymore. So one thing we see here is the hundred rupee note didn't lose its value. In the same way, no matter how much life will crumble us, life will squeeze us, we are not gonna lose our value. Correct. We are not uh, uh, defined by our successes or the gold medals we achieve. We are who we are. Yeah, we are who we are. And if uh, you talk about failure, uh, I think we all know two people whom we know them by their failures itself. So this first lady was uh, diagnosed with clinical depression. Her marriage had fell apart. She had a child and was a jobless. She was on a four-hour delayed journey from Manchester to England, and that is when she had got this idea. Let me write a book about a wizard. Ah, J.K. Rowling. I did writing this. See, without me yeah. telling the aim, you all guessed it. It was J.K. Yeah. Rowling. So after finishing the book, she took it to twelve. Oh my God! Yes, and yes. she was rejected by all of. Yes. So after taking it to twelve publishers and getting rejected, and then she became J.K. Rowling. Who she is? We all know Harry Potter. Potter. Harry Potter. So failure is something which will come before success. And the second one, if you know, his first company had been crumbled. He was a Harvard dropout, and the demo of his first company when he was giving didn't even work. But he went on to build Microsoft, Bill Gates. Yes. Yeah. So, yes. Whatever. Before achieving success, whatever we envision for ourselves, we end up achieving far more than that. We have to start embracing failure. I think one thing our society does bad is we don't talk about failure. We only talk about success after we done. But what we all know is the work we had put in in these two years of need. That is one. That is the thing that is leading to success. It is not the overnight need result that comes that has led to the. Yeah, How well said. How well said. How well said. You you look very confident. You speak very well, but I'm sure Ganesh at some time you had a lot of self doubt. You used to feel like I don't want to use the word loser. It's a very serious word. But कभी तो आपको भी लगा होगा यार. Yes. So how did you overcome self doubt? What did you do to overcome? And it's a very like I have self doubt. Right? There are so many, and that's the reason I tell you something very honestly. That's the reason I stopped seeking validation. आज की डेट में आई डोंट सीक वैलिडेशन मुझे आई डोंट यूज कस वर्ड्स बट मुझे फर्क ही नहीं पड़ता कि कोई मेरे बारे में क्या सोच रहा है या क्या बोल रहा है आई डो आई हैव स्टॉप सीकिंग वैलिडेशन आई वांट टू गेट फिट बिकॉज़ आई वांट टू बी स्ट्रांग आई डोंट वांट टू गेट फिट बिकॉज़ आई वांट टू लुक अ सर्टेन वे राइट एंड व्हाटएवर आई डू आई बिकॉज़ वैलिडेशन जब भी आप सीक करते हो ना दुनिया मुझे अच्छा बोले ये मुझे अच्छा बोले वो मुझे अच्छा बोले यू आर इन योर हार्ट ऑफ हार्ट ग्रोइंग सेल्फ डाउट बिकॉज़ देन यू आर ऑलवेज doubtful of who you are and you want others to validate you and that took me adulthood to realize that we all have self doubt aajkal kids are very smart but all my teenage years were full of self doubt i had curly hair that time curly hair was like oh my god such big thing i was very tall in my class so i was full of self doubt which took me a lot of unlearning how did you did you have self doubt and how did you cope with it yeah. i think we are all living our two lives one is the life we want for ourselves and one is the life we think others want for us <laughs> and we get stuck in between these two lives yeah. so i was during the need journey all my friends had left me alone because i couldn't attend parties and yes you we've talked about it yes yeah. yes tell us and yes. Then i spoke to you and about rohani ma hmm. so that time rohani ma was my biology teacher at vedantum so she told it's okay if your friends left you i will be your best friend from today and if you see My entire batch will call me and Rohani Ma'am as the Tom and Jerry of the class. Really? The class wouldn't start without us fighting. <laughs> That was the beautiful relation I had with my teacher. So even your teachers can become your best friends sometimes. Yeah. And it is my teachers 
that made me realize that I was worthful. So right now I'm speaking very confidently. But if I go down four years back, I had an English teacher at school. I think I hated my voice. I was like I would sound very bad. The mic nobody would want to listen to me. But then she encouraged me to speak up, and from then I had been giving many speeches at. Uh, you were in KV, sir. Yeah, I was in KV. KV Anil. Hmm. From then I got this confidence of speaking, and now I'm no more scared to speak. I just speak whatever I. So it does take a little push. That so, find that right person in your life. There's this you. very beautiful thing I've heard. I think on the internet, a bottle of water is twenty rupees at the supermarket. The same bottle of water is fifty rupees at the restaurant. Hundred rupees at the movie theater and two hundred rupees at the airport. So here, if you see, it's the same bottle of water, but what it changes, what changes its value is its location. So next time you feel you are worthless, remember you are maybe just at the wrong place. Oh yeah, lovely. How nice. Okay, I'll come to one last question. Everybody gives gyan, and there's so much of it on internet. Ye karo, ye karo, ye karo, ye karo, ye karo, ye karo. क्या ना कर वॉट इज इट किड्स शुड नॉट डू वॉट इज इट किड्स शुड अवॉइड ड्यूरिंग नीट प्रिपरेशन अकॉर्डिंग टू यू क्या ना कर सो आई थिंक हाउ मेनी ऑफ यू स्पेंड योर टाइम मल्टी टास्क मोस्ट ऑफ अस स्पेंड योर टाइम मल्टी टास्क आई एम ऑल्सो गिल्टी बट स्टडी शो दैट ओनली टू परसेंट ऑफ दर्ल्ड कैन एक्चुअली मल्टी टास्क एंड जब हम ये सुनते हैं या इसमें मैं हूँ मोस्ट ऑफ अस बट द ट्रूथ इज यू आर नॉट एंड आई एम ऑल्सो नॉट So the first thing we have to accept is we cannot multitask. Yeah. Most of us, including me, as students, while doing physics, we think about that chemistry question there. While doing the biology, hundred percent with you on those question physics. Me, I who are yes. We start thinking about things which we are not doing at the present moment. So if we start living at the present moment and focus on the task you are doing right now, you are more close to achieving success. So till twelfth standard, I was also multitasking. But then uh, I slowly learn to focus on the goal I am doing right now and living at the present moment instead of thinking the past or future. So that is one thing I want all the neat aspirants or any students to avoid. Stop How long task. did it take you to be mindful? It took almost one year. I wasted one year multitasking. I would do physics, chemistry simultaneously. Both are maths. He has to chalega. Then I would uh, start drawing a biology diagram and think about some question I got wrong in the test. So it is very important that we start living in the present moment, and it will take time. Any habit takes time to develop, but when we keep coming and showing up every day, you will eventually develop it. So we don't rise to the level of our goals; instead, we fall to the level of our systems. Yes, I'm a habit. So the more we focus on our habits and building day-to-day tasks, the more successful we become. Yeah. So there are two books I would want you to read here, which changed my entire perspective on this. One is Deep Work. So there's a book called Deep Work. Uh, if you can read it, it's very nice. It talks about how you should take out some time every day to do the most important work. It's called Deep Work. Very very nice book. And one is Atomic Habits. Okay. Phenomenal. Yes, yes. Very very nice. So Atomic Habits, very good. How to set up habits, cues, and things like that. Super amazing. आप किसी भी एज में बहुत सिंपल लिखी हैं दोनों बुक. You must read Deep Work and you must read Atomic Habits. Thank you so much, Ganesh. It was a pleasure. It was a pleasure having you. So that's all from today. Wait for the next episode coming soon. Take care.